guys, so I'm going to do an ultra haul today and it's going to be from two places, um, drugstore.com and Pretty and Cute, which is an Asian beauty site. Um, so I'm just going to start off with drugstore.com. Um, first of all, the company is a partner with Market America, so you can actually get, I think, 4% cash back now just from shopping through Market America at drugstore.com and it's basically like a CVS or like a Long's Drugs online. So you can get all your cool over-the-counter beauty products, prescription meds, things like that from there. So what I got from there was a bunch of EOS lip balms. Like I got the tangerine one and I got the lemon drop lip balm one. The lemon drop has an SPF 15. The tangerine one is medicated. And then I also got these limited edition um, berry EOS lip balms. I think they're berry. Yeah, passion fruit and raspberry sorbet. Cute! And they are limited edition, so if you want them, you should get them right away because I don't know when they're going to stop carrying them. And the other thing that I got was a 3D white crest strip. And it was on sale for, I think, 30 something dollars. I'll check. But it um it's usually like about 40 or 50 dollars. And I think it's working. Like I've been doing it for five days. So I have um seven more days to go, eight more days to go. And so far I think it's pretty good. Um it's the two hour ones by the way. Now for pretty and cute, I learned from the site from Jen from Head to Toe. She's another YouTuber. And um, she was talking about it. it, sounded really cool, so I checked it out. I think this site is not as good as Sasa, but it is good in the sense that it has some products that Sasa does not carry. So that's why I purchased some things on this site. I will make a Sasa haul though. I'll definitely be purchasing stuff from Sasa in the future. Um, there's tons and tons of stuff, and I do think it's all around probably better, like especially in terms of price. But Pretty and Cute does have some stuff that Sasa doesn't have, so yeah. So the things I got from Pretty and Cute was the Vita Shake Pack from Leo Ellie. Is that how you pronounce it? Leo Ellie? I think so. Anyways, the Vita Shake Pack has these little packets of facial masks that you can apply to your face. And it is apple mango flavor. It comes in five different flavors, I believe. The apple mango one hydrates skin deeply to improve dryness and softens and clears dead skin cells for even denser and smoother skin textures. So I got it pretty much because I felt like my skin has kind of weird textures sometimes, like from acne scarring. So I thought it would be really good. And it's absolutely so cute with like these individual packets you tear at the top. And then you squeeze out, it's a gel-like consistency, and then you just put it all over your face. And I feel like it will help, but I only tried one, so I'm not really sure how good it is, but I will let you guys know. But I just thought it was so adorable, and also Sasa does not carry this product. I don't even know if Sasa carries Leo Ellie, so I just thought that was like worth it. And also... These really cute eyelashes. Oh, cute eyelashes. I got a bunch of these hair Velcros. And they come in all different colors. My sis actually got the white one. So I got the pink with the hearts, the red with the hearts, and the blue with the hearts. Or blue with the dots. And you can see it up close. It's so cute. I love it. And they're all about $4, under $4. So about Pretty and Cute, the site is pretty decent. It has a lot of cute stuff. It has sales. Um, what I do like is when they ship you your package, they include this business card, which has all their information on it. And they include a sample of your choice. So when you finish at checkout, purchasing your items, you can choose different from different samples. So we, me and my sis got a Leo LA Multi Seaweed Gel. So that's awesome because sometimes you shop at sites and they don't even give you anything like for free. So I thought that was cool. 
<clears throat> but the cons about the site is that it's not I'm not sure if the quality of the products is always really good um, in terms of the beauty products it's been pretty good packaging is pretty good it's you know cute pretty and cute it's cute and it's pretty decent packaging but my sis did purchase this contact case which she said like here's the contacts and here's the contact stuff she said the contacts looked kind of dirty so I don't know if that was I don't know whose fault that was I don't know if it was like the company made a mistake or the company's um, manufacturers made a mistake I don't know but that's a little bit gross also I don't know if you can you guys can see on my phone yeah, kind of, but the case has a little bit of scratching on it. And it's brand new, like we bought it brand new, so it should not have any scratches on it. Um, she feels like that it's kind of, it was kind of reused or something, like maybe somebody returned it and then they just shipped it out like it was brand new, you know what I mean? So I don't know what the deal on that was, but that was the only bad thing. So... All in all, pretty good stuff. Um, if you guys want reviews on any of the products, let me know. And other than that, hope you guys have a good day. Bye.